Hey guys, it's me again. I haven't seen you guys in a while. I'm with Kristen. It's kind of dark and Hubert's in the back. We're just headed into the mall because... Oh, yeah. <laughs> she said it. All week, Kristen's like texting me. I want Froyo. 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 Randomly, like this wasn't all, all at once. It was randomly through the week. I want Froyo. We should go. I want Froyo. We should go. We and snow. snow. Yeah, we got snow. Look at the snow. Well, you can't. It's like all piled up. But yeah, we're at the uh, Mayflower Mall. And uh, there's... We don't have mint cheese, me. But we have... Yeah. But right. that's probably going to close too. Yeah, because they're starting to do a thing where you can like fill your cup Friday sort of thing at like a set price, which is usually... It's usually like 64 cents an ounce or something. But it might be just because of the winter too. And we're not going to be able to go to Starbucks anymore. Yeah, and we're losing our Starbucks because yeah, I haven't talked to you guys in a while. But Target is closing in Canada. Uh, Canada, which it's, is really yeah, stupid. it's uh, every location in Canada. Is Target came in too aggressively into Canada. I think yes. that's my opinion on. They should have started off with like one in each province or something. Yeah, they opened up 133 stores literally within six months of each other. And people just didn't take to it and in Canada. And they're not going to apparently make profit until, what, 2025? 2021 so it's like, or something, so yeah. So let's lose billions of dollars so we cannot wait, like, what, 10 years for profit. That doesn't make any sense yeah. to me. I, love, I like Target, don't get me wrong, but I'm just very disappointed in them that yeah. they're pulling out of Canada that fast. So, but they're just trying to, they're trying to protect their investors, I guess. Bosh, they came, I think, I honestly think they Look came in too aggressively. Ooh. And yeah, yeah that's what spot. I think the problem was. I think if they had to open, like Kristen said, a few at a time. Yeah. But now it looks they like. They don't a, need to completely close Target Canada. No. Please. And it looks like uh, IKEA is looking at the, some of the properties for expanding. IKEA is already in Canada. It's so. our only Starbucks on the island that's in Target. Yeah, so we only no have one, Yeah, no more Starbucks for us. Anyway, we're getting into the car now. There's one other thing I want to show you guys Ramel Apocalypse. It looks cool. I'm going to test it. See what it looks like after I eat frozen yogurt. Because it's supposed to be long lasting. Like 16 hours. We shall see. See, we're going to. Yeah. Not sports check. Well, we'll probably look around the mall too. I don't know. But I haven't vlogged in a while. So I figured I'd say hi to you guys. And I'll check in with you guys. In a I'll show you what kind of frozen yogurt I got. Yeah, that sounds good. I got Nutella and vanilla mixed with chocolate crisps and some peaches. Or peaches. Yeah. And what did you get, Miss Crazy? Uh, chocolate cookie dough, chocolate chips, and M Nims. I'm going to have to see what concoction Hubert comes over with. <laughs> Hubert, explain your concoction again. There's chocolate, there's Nutella, chocolate Nutella. And then there's chocolate chips, white chocolate chips, chocolate sprinkles, three chocolate pretzels, one of these chocolate things, <laughs> chocolate sprinkles, and uh, mini chocolate peanut butter cups. You're going to be in a chocolate, chocolate coma. <laughs> Kristen is pondering the question in the mall, should she or shouldn't she? And I'll show you what it is in a minute. Should she or shouldn't she? Should she or shouldn't she? Let's go see. <laughs> it would match her room on an everyday basis. So, it's Valentine's Day. But it's Valentine's Day. We should see. I'll show you guys. It's in this quilt store. And Kristen's bedroom is gray, black, white, and red. So she's looking at this. It is Valentine's Day core. But she could use it in her room all year because red's one of her colors. I think... It's only polka dots. It's not hearts, so it's not like yes, a technical thing. I don't know. I don't see hearts. Take a look. Oh, you can't even tell that. Yeah, they, they just, just look like polka dots. It's really soft. I think she's going to. Yes. She could change her mind between you and the cash. That's not so true. We're headed into Target. Sadly, it is closing in Canada, like I said. So we're taking advantage as much as we can. On what site? Oh, oh like park. Kristen parks like an ass. No, I'm just joking. No, I was just saying how bad I was when I first got my license, but it's gotten a lot better. She has gotten a lot better. But yeah, and this is the only Starbucks that we have in Cape Breton, and we're losing that too, so that sucks. But anyway, we're going to go inside and see if there's anything on decent sale. 
check this out. Okay guys, so I know the lighting is bad, but we were just in Target and I actually want to cry because Starbucks is literally gone, gone. already. It's like they're we cleaning out. What, a week ago? Yeah, we only found out like last Thursday that Target was leaving Canada and because Target was here in Cape Breton, Starbucks was inside the Target because they're inside all, pretty much all Targets, I believe. The Starbucks. And it's the and it's the only Starbucks that we have on Cape Breton Island and we went in there today and they're literally clearing it out and I just I feel like crying. No uh, more Target. No more Target, no more Starbucks. Like there's nowhere to shop here as it is and then they're gonna go take away Target. And then like, I overheard, so we, me and Kristen overheard one of the workers saying within four weeks Target will be gone completely from here. So, and you know what guys, they just stopped off uh, they just stocked up the goddamn butter glosses. Yeah. Like, literally just stocked them up the now. The place around here you can get butter glosses. Yeah, I didn't buy any today either, though, because I'm, I gotta wait till my payday. But hopefully there'll be still some in on payday. If not, I'll have to get somebody to get them for me. But, yeah, they literally just stocked up. the All three colors that I wanted were there, too. Actually, it was a major stock, though. There was only about three of every color there. Yeah. But still, hopefully they'll still have Target, some left. The only place that sells awesome knee socks for literally, like, three bucks, and they're awesome. Yeah. I just, I'm so disappointed. I mean, I'm gonna be jealous every time somebody does a haul. And I got this at Target, I'm gonna be like, you suck. Yeah, every time we see Target hauls on YouTube, we're gonna be like, you suck. I don't like you. But I tweet at Target, and I honestly think, and you guys should help me, and you guys should tweet them too. And let them know that since they're closing Target in Canada, a lot of us Canadians love Target, and they should open up Target.com shopping to Canadian customers. They won't ship Canada. Because they won't ship to Canada as of now, but they should do it. So you guys tweet them too. too. We should not be neglected of Target. <laughs> we like it. We I just because a few people they think that the well, not a few, but like I mean it didn't do good. And honestly, the um, shelves weren't stocked fast enough here because I think there was issues with shipping from the U.S. to Canada, and they weren't shipping it out fast enough. Like Walmart, for instance, has Canadian shipping houses that ship out to the Canadian Walmarts. Target needed that too. But anyway, I'm very sad. So this is kind of a rant video. I'm kind of upset. I loved, I love you Target, but I'm upset at you at the same time. Yeah. So there that's... was no need of completely closing Target Canada. I'm sorry, there was no. Yeah. Maybe a couple stores, but not completely Target Canada. I'm so upset. I'm upset. Uh, but tweet Target guys and tell them open up it, open up the shipping to Canadian customers. Yeah. We <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. We're going to Walmart now, <laughs> and I'm kind of like, meh, but we got to kill time. Actually... Going to go outside and play in the snow, Mommy? Are we going to go play in the snow? Are you going to go play in the snow? Yeah? You're going to go play in the snow? Are you excited? Look, there's lots of snow out there. You're going to go play? Going outside to play in the snow? Okay, let me get, let me get her ski pants. I'll go. Get your ball. Get your ball. Cassie's giving you, ha ah, ah, ha ha, you flipped it over there, ding ling ding ling what was that? Where'd it go? There you go. It's right there, Griffin. <laughs> you stoopy. <laughs> He's a stoopy head. Where's your ball? Get it. <laughs> well, you want me to bury it again? You want me to bury it again? I will. Hold on. Casper's first time in snow. And he's gonna take off on me. He don't care that it's like minus 10 degrees out and freezing. Look at him go, look. He doesn't care at all, not a care in the world. Okay, I gotta go catch him before he takes off too far. The snow is beautiful. I like light snow. Alright, he throws right at me. That is cool though, because it made Griffin come right towards me. Cassie can barely move. He 
just hops right through the snow. Snow, throw it down there where there's no snow. <laughs> I mean, no, no. I mean, obviously there's snow where there's no footprints. What's wrong, you peanut? Okay, come on back, Griffin. <laughs> Cassie trying to move around now. Just stay in the footprints, Cassie. So this nut just decided he's going to lay down in the snow. Griffin. And he's eating it. Griffin, where's your treats? Cassie didn't like it. It was too much to hear. We're talking her up there where it's shoveled so she can just do her own thing. She doesn't like outside that much in the snow. He loves it. Where's your ball? Daddy's coming back. Get your ball. Get your ball. Do it. Get the snow. <laughs> You're going to land on me. Wow. This is our Valentine's Day date. <laughs> Daddy's cold. Hey guys, I just thought you'd like to see some randomness from the last couple of weeks, just some clips that I got here and there. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little vlog of randomness. <laughs>